I have in hand sunglasses. That's not really in hand, but uh, a mythical Petcha Berry and the trailer showed here. Don't be shy. Lovely of you to stop by and take your time and have a look around. Oh, okay. It's not just come here. Uh, well, I was hitting the bumpers to cycle pages. I don't know what game I'm getting mixed up with there. I... What? Where... Where do I find the mythical Petcha Berry? Talk to the decoration? Oh. <laughs> There's a dusty old decoration of some sort mixed in with all the daily goods and things. And it smells incredibly sweet. <laughs> oh, that bush just spawned on the right side. Decoration appeared to move a little bit. Rotototo. I would never have guessed that, so I appreciate the heads up. Harmonia, yo, Arvin here. I heard the news. You've been having all kinds of big adventures, huh, little buddy? School trips, studying abroad, what luck. Oh, it's not that big of a deal. You're kidding me? Man, acting like this is kind of, wait, acting like this kind of thing is normal. What a world traveler. Now that I think about it, it's been one crazy thing after another since you came to our school. You know, I should be pretty used to seeing this game by now, but somehow looking over at the the foliage, the flowers, and the hedges there and stuff, especially that one hedge that's just to the right of my head and the purple flowers are right beside it, just looks so much like a PS2 game. This has been real busy lately, but are things starting to settle down? I was thinking that if you have time, and only if you want, of course, maybe, I could come visit you at your house? Uh, of course, come right over. I'm not there. <laughs> Seriously? Such a relief to hear you say that. Get pranked. I'm not there. Without even the tiniest hesitation. So I guess I'll come over. Your house is in Cabo Pauk. Cabo Pauk. Whatever. I'll meet you out front. See you right there. Joke's on him. I'm here. Oh, it's gone. The Hidden Treasure of Area Zero Epilogue. Mochi Mayhem. Who would guess that you need to interact with that if we didn't have the internet? And yet, Game Freak never wanted to release the Azure Flute. Well, until BDSP, I guess. You know, because I loaded up BDSP earlier today to put my party into the boxes so that I could transfer them out, I did see that the Azure Flute was literally just there in my, uh, in my house on the ground and picked it up and transferred my party to the boxes and saved and quit. So I now own the Azure Flute and BDSP. And I still think it's funny that I, when that event first came out, I put it to a vote of, hey, there's a new co- Oh yeah, I forgot, this is useless. Um, I put it to a vote in the uh, Discord server of, hey, there's new content out for Pokemon BDSP. Should I cover it or screw that noise? And more people voted for screw that noise. So we never did it. <laughs> We never did the Arceus event. So, yeah. There's a uh, there's that. <laughs> Jeff, I kind of funny. The Azure Flute is too hard, but catching Meloetta and Terrarium is too easy. Even a baby could do it. Yeah, that's what I said! <laughs> Always on her phone, that Penny. There he is. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Harmonia. Look at all these pumpkins. This area looks so much better at night than it does at day. <laughs> Figured I'd tag along. Hey there. Uh, what's going on? This is an intervention. Harmonia, I... This is all my fault. Sorry. You know, when I called you and said I wanted to come hang? Well, these two overheard and... Well, we weren't just going to let you hog the chance to visit Harmonia. He's the main character that has no agency of his own. It's way more fun to roll together. You say that, but who wants a bunch of uninvited guests? That's just rude. Uh, vote now on your phones. Wait for the mods for BDSP, though. Yeah, the modding that's going on that's in progress, it's looking really good. Once ROM hacks start rolling out for that game, they're probably going to be really nice. I guess if you're fine with it, Harmonia, I guess I can't really complain either. Okay, listen up, you two. We're not allowed to cause any trouble for Harmonia as mom. Got it? Gonna be the perfect guest today. You bet. I don't know who you think you're educating here, but sure, whatever. <laughs> oh, man. 
Little do they know that you manipulated the timeline into having them like you. With a few saves and reloads. Man, when's the last time that we've been here? Literally over a year ago. <laughs> in, in real lifetime. That was such a great meal. Can't believe we got all that after we barged in out of nowhere. That's what happens at my family's lake cabin all the time. In a, uh, in a small summer village in a rural area like that, everyone knows one another, so sometimes people will just, like, come in and hang out, and one thing leads to another, and then we all have dinner. <laughs> it's just what happens there. So different than city life. Mom's cooking is so good, Harmonia. Right? She's so pretty. My brain literally glitched when I saw her. Okay, you're at, like, a 12 right now. I'm gonna need you to take you down to, like, a 2. I... I did not know what to expect from this DLC, but... Penny having a hard-on for my mom is not something that I can say I expected. I'm so glad she remembered me. And look at this huge room. Doesn't make you feel all boxed in like the dorm rooms do. Yeah, like literally every dorm room everywhere on the planet. <laughs> it's super cute. Seriously. Almost too much for me to take. Oh, it's a Nintendo Switch. You have to tell me what games you've got on this thing. Okay. A few. I love this Squovet plush. The fluffs to die for. <laughs> Look at the Krogunk ball. I, uh, I don't know if anyone noticed, but I was having a look at the 3D print cam here on, like, the starting suit screen, and I saw that my goofy little toothless plush barely shows up there. You can see it on, like, the starting suit screen here, but not, uh, not on the little screen. And I was like, hmm, is there anything else that I can put in there? And I have a little Krogunk plush, so I put it on top of the Toothless plush. And now it's like the Krogunk is kind of riding the Toothless plush, I guess, there. Think about Krogunk. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. I have it lag as we switch back here, and it loads all those images and stuff. How's everybody doing? Anyone want dessert? I was thinking of bringing up some sweets. Sweets? Yes! No way! I couldn't possibly ask you for more food. We don't mean to be a hustle. We don't mean to be a hustle? Like, I know there's sentences like, we don't mean to be too much trouble for you or anything like that. I've never heard this phrase before. Hassle, I mean, oh, we don't want to be a hassle. Oh, sweetie, there's no need to stand on ceremony here. Just make yourselves at home and relax. When was the last time we saw mom here? Over a hundred parts ago? Yes, ma'am. And 20 streams ago? Oh, and Harmonia, a letter came for you. It's from Kieran. Do you know a Kieran? Uh, no! Really? Well, that's odd. Still, it was addressed to you, so I suppose I shouldn't read it. Here you are. Dear pesky plumbers, the Koopalings and I have taken over the Mushroom Kingdom. The princess is now a permanent guest at one of our seven Koopa hotels or whatever the heck the thing is. Bring those sweets up in just a few. Hope you'll all enjoy them. Man, this makes me want to grab some snacks after this stream is done. I'll come help. <laughs> Maybe I will, as a matter of fact. God, I want to check out the sweets too! Mom sure is nice, Harmonia. You're real lucky. Sorry to make you feel bad about your situation, Arvin. And sorry that I kind of enabled her. Even if it's not in this timeline, there's still some timeline out there where I enabled her by giving her the Hidden Treasure of Area Zero book <laughs> to continue working at her time machine and ignoring her son, so, you know. And now here I am, just rubbing it in his face. <laughs> Complete dickish behavior by the Gen 9 protagonist. So, but what about that letter? Aren't you gonna at least open it up? Dear Harmonia. <laughs> I thought it was a letter! I didn't realize this was a friggin' Minecraft book! Um, <laughs> Dear Harmonia, how are you doing lately? <laughs> I took a leave from school, so I'm back in Mosui Town for a while. My sis came back with me too. And it's literally a Minecraft book! <laughs> we didn't get much chance to talk after everything that happened in the under depths. I'd really like to catch up. Think you could swing a visit to Kitagami? Karma would love to see you, I'm sure. Maybe you could bring your friends from Paldea too. I include plenty of tickets. Okay, Mr. Moneybags over here, I see how it is. But yeah, I didn't realize this was gonna be the storytelling approach of my Minecraft playthrough. <laughs> Just do it in Minecraft books. <laughs> Who's this Kieran guy? Some new 
friend or something? Uh, yeah, just a friend. Yeah, he's a friend. <laughs> the weird hesitation. There's some kind of story there? Not that it's my business. Ammonia, Arvin, you're not gonna believe how good this stuff looks. There's too much to carry upstairs. Come on down here and eat. Shannamona. Hasn't she ever heard of an inside voice? Again, I hope I'm not peeking. I do see that I'm going into the red in OBS. I started to notice how my streams were like... Well, I've noticed for a while that my streams were very quiet. And upload onto YouTube, my videos would be a lot quieter compared to a lot of other people's. And I didn't know if there was anything that I could do to fix that per se. Because the audio levels that I have here, even sliding them to zero here, it was still too too quiet and it was kind of peaking in the red here and not all that great and uh, so I didn't really want to do that and if I turned up the gain to a manual preset that's higher than this like say plus 10 decibels this is zero the moment I adjust it it just goes back to this being zero and then this being minus 12 and all that and then it undoes the additional stuff that I did but I recently found out that there's some filters that you can put on of like gain just plus 10 to the default value but that can apparently bring it close to peaking, so I saw it recommended online to put a limiter of minus three. However that works, I don't know. So I applied this to all the things. Gain limiter. So it's a little bit of an experiment. I see I'm going into the red sometimes, so if I sound a little bit scratchier than usual, and it's peaking sometimes, let me know. I did a little bit of a test before I started the stream and it sounded fine, but who knows. <laughs> Things can be a uh, subject to variation as I continue to stream here. So this is my this is my little experiment to fix the the stream is insanely quiet issue. And if it's still a little bit quiet with the plus ten, then maybe I'll up it to plus fifteen or plus twenty or whatever it takes. Um, I guess we better go. She'll just keep on shouting. I hope there's nobody that watched this a Scarlet and Violet playthrough playlist and went from part whatever the last one was one thirty I think. Let me double check here. Um, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, the last part was, yeah, 130, to the beginning of this stream, part 131, and just had their ears blasted <laughs> from the difference between parts. Hope that didn't happen. Oh, my poor gut. I feel like I'll burst if I eat another bite. I think what you're trying to say is, thank you so much for feeding us. It was all really delicious, right? I'll help with the dishes and stuff. Oh, aren't you the sweetest thing? Wow, this... With how bland this whole place is and how much you see that with these different camera angles, it looks like the set of a tacky cooking show. Um, <laughs> but no need to lift a finger. You kids just take it easy. Thanks, ma'am. You're the best. Moist voiceover is on minus three to minus six hertz on the limiter there. Interesting. Because I've never tinkered with that kind of thing before. I probably should have tinkered with it years ago. Um, at least Nimona's got manners, so I'll give her that. You could have offered with the dishes too, Arvin. <laughs> Look at my stupid glasses. I don't like this one. Huh? Why are you looking at me? Why the flowers on the table there actually look pretty good? Say, Harmonia, what that letter? Was that place your new pal mentioned? Kitakami or something? Really gonna go there and meet this Kieran guy again? Uh, vote now on your phones. Wait, what? You going somewhere? Oh, uh. Did we miss something? Something good? Spell it! It all started 40 years ago. Are you serious? We're definitely going with you. This Kieran kid was champion of a super elite battle academy, right? I've got to meet him. Or, like, I've got to battle him. Was it that obvious? I feel kind of bad, though. We just invite ourselves along on your trip without asking. The guy said to bring friends, and where are those friends? He even sent tickets for us. Yeah, super convenient there. Yep, friends equals us. Ergo, we get the tickets. You bet we do. Again, the player having no agency, just going along with what everyone else expects for them. This will be my first time going on a trip with friends. It's kind of scary and exciting at the same time. Uh, now that you mention it, I don't think I've ever taken a trip with a friend either. You're kidding. Oh, this is gonna be amazing, so get excited. Okay, Senku. Uh, last time I went on a trip with a friend was to Vancouver Island with a friend of mine from Germany, Finn there. Anyone that watched the, uh, Fragapalooza stuff from this last year saw him doing some gaming stuff with us there. Um, 
I went to uh, Vancouver Island with him for a while. That was fun. We rented a car and went up island a little bit. That was a cool trip. I better at least tell the housekeeper over at my place I'll be away for a while. Why don't we break for now? Do whatever prep we gotta do and meet up again later. Sounds good. Let's say we meet up again in front of Mesa Gosa's southern gate. Roger. See y'all later then. I don't know why we don't all just meet up here or something, but uh... Thanks for having us over! Meanwhile, you'll never tell how I truly feel with these uh, sunglasses on. Oh, did Mona and the others leave already? They s they literally all yelled. Did you not read the last text box? Your friends are all such nice kids. I was really glad to meet them all. Now it sounds like you're all about to go have a little adventure together, hmm? Well, have fun if you do. No fighting, and be sure to look after one another. Oh, okay. I still have squirrels in the house. A pet squirrel kind of not typically a good thing to have. <laughs> but yeah, let's see here. Eddie anyway, Arvin definitely had another jealousy issue there, maybe. Um, oh wait, they're creating animations for some of the GL, don't know what that stands for. Cyrus, Cynthia, Elite Four, and Barry, similar to Platinum, what with the uh, BDSP modding and stuff. But yeah, I don't know what this stuff with the buddy bags is, I'm sorry to say. Where's the door? Jeez. <laughs> My oh my. Well, the cross guard's at 24% printed, according to the thing, the LED display thing where Bob. Man, when was the last time that we were here? Get a reminder of how good it looks. Actually looks not as bad as my memories told me that it looked, but still. Well, whoa, that's how physics work. <laughs> With going at slopes like this and being turned at an angle, it makes me feel like I'm playing Sonic 06. I've never even played Sonic 06, but I've seen gameplay of it where that happens. There's like, here's the street, here's the sidewalk, and they'll stand on the edge and then Sonic's just tilted over like that. And it's really funny. All right, let's fly here. Let's fly on over this way. All right, I guess our friends are coming with us to Kitakami. What's up, how's it going? Hey, over here. Over here, because you didn't hear me the first time. All right, Harmonia, did you load up on travel snacks? Your bag full of grub? Oh my gosh, Dad, will you just drop it? I told you, friends, I'm going with friends. It's not Harmonia's mom. No, you don't need to be worried about it. We are perfectly capable of taking care of ourselves. Uh, no, it's not gonna be an adventure. No one says that. Honestly, I'm hanging up now. Uh, suddenly, I'm too tired for any of this. Yeah, your old man's okay to go. Yeah, in the end, I had to put up with his ultra mega annoying dad talk to do it. He just ultra mega cares, little bud. Oh, oh, yeah, maybe you're right. Okay, we've all got permission and we're all here. No one forgot anything, right? Then vamos, let's go. Let's go. It confirms that Penny is Peony's daughter. How? This game doesn't have voice acting. <laughs> Alright, away we go. Oh, that's my performance was just so dang flawless. Wait, no, I didn't eat. He didn't even have any lines there. So, like. <laughs> so, I mean. Here we are. Oh, so this is Mosui Town? You all smell that, right? It kind of smells different than Paldea. Oh my goodness, that entire shed spawned in. Almost every time that the camera cuts over, there will be something popping in in the background. And I don't say anything about it over half the time because I've just kind of accepted it. But whenever it's something that large and in charge, it's like... Wow. 
My head's still spinning too fast to see anything. Are we there yet? You wouldn't have gotten so carsick if you hadn't stared at your phone the whole bus ride. I didn't know if we got signal here. I had to load up on internet goodness while I could. Why, hello there, assholes! Oh, and that whole shop spawned into. Hiya. Hiya, indeed. I'm the caretaker here, and it's a pleasure to welcome you to our town. Kian had mentioned you all would be coming. Harmonia aside, this is everyone's first time visiting Kitakami, is that right? No! What are you saying? It really is the first time for the rest of us. I see, I see. Well, again, you're most welcome. You can sleep here at the community center. All the rooms have been freshened up for you. Well, now that's some thoughtful service. <laughs> there was no trouble, no trouble at all. Uh, now, please, relax and enjoy yourselves, but most of all, enjoy Kitakami. Thanks very much, sir. So, what about that Kieran guy? Have you heard from him at all? I nod while I have the dots here. And all the Vulpix and Hoot Hoot spawned in. Excuse me? He doesn't have a smartphone? How is this kid even alive? Let's not want any distractions from training. Think he's at his house? Should we go meet him? Sure. Yeah, her name in Japan is Batan Tree Peony. Oh, and Arvin briefly being banished to the Shadow Realm for one frame. Also, the Adventure line is specific to Peony. Oh, interesting. I wouldn't remember. I'm honestly, I forgot that Calyrex even existed before <laughs> this DLC came out, and there was a stuff with snacks worth in the available legendary Pokemon. Like. The whole Calyrex and Steeds and stuff like that. I completely forgot about it until not that long ago. And is she British then? Oh, and she's... He's a... Uh, still the edgelord kind of look though. Harmonia. Oh man, it's been a long time. Thanks so much for coming. Sorry that I couldn't come meet you at the bus stop. Things have been crazy at home. Uh... Had it all in hand? Oh, just like we had it handled. I was like, what? Um, it's great to see you, man. <sighs> Thanks. Oh, wait. Did you come all by yourself? Yeah, we're here too. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Nimona. You're Kieran, yeah? Harmonia told us all about you. Like, how you're great at Pokemon battles, right? Well, uh, I don't know about that but dial it back a notch or nine. You're scaring him. I'm Penny. I like a certain someone. I'm fine with taking friendships nice and slow. And there's that gate spawning in, and I'm Arvin, Harmonia's absolute best friend. Sticking your claim right from the get-go, huh? Well, I'm Kieran. I met Harmonia when he came here for that school trip. That's when we became friends. Um, what else? Oh, I'm a student at Blueberry Academy. Uh, I mean, I was a student there. I'm on a break right now. There's the gate popping in again. Well, really? I know how that goes. Same thing happened to me. Penny, don't go sympathizing with the enemy. I could count on you to at least keep this interloper at arm's length. Eh, I just get the feeling we're pretty alike. Wow, your friends seem like a quirky group. Kinda like you, huh? Anyways, a friend of Harmonia's a friend of mine. Hope you all have a good time staying in Kitakami. Thanks, now let's battle. I, uh, what? That space in front of the community center looked like a good battle spot. Vamos, come on! Does she want me to go with her? Am I supposed to go battle her? Uh, vote now on your phones! Oh man, she's just as pushy as Sis is, but like, different. Is your sis back to being pushy again? She kind of lost her pushiness after you went into edgelord mode. You kind of became the pushy one during that phase. Oh no, I I think I might have made a terrible mistake. This Kieran kid might actually be a good guy. Of course he is. He's friends with Harmonia. A character with no agency of their own. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay, met protagonist on a school trip. They Stockholm syndrome you into being their friend. 
I mean, Kieran's kind of the one that wanted to be our friend in the first place. I've got some pocket money. Also, after the epilogue, because I have that stuff for the decks, I can go talk to you. I'll, I'll do that later. <laughs> Wee. Wee. Oh my goodness. I cannot turn very sharply, can I? Ah! <laughs> okay. I would just talk. You weren't kidding. Kieran's great. Let me see. Which Pokemon should I use for our next battle? Oh. You're done? What now then? Oh. Okay, talk to Kieran is what now? I got completely destroyed. Who the heck is Nimona anyway? Uh, use my rival. Consider her a rival, Harmonia? Okay, yeah. Makes sense she's so good then. Kieran, you're so good. That was awesome. No wonder you were the champion of the fancy pants school of yours. But, but, I couldn't beat you. Does it really matter? Whether you win or lose, Pokemon battles are a blast. Yeah, it's true. Also, unrelated, but for whatever reason, my arms are going numb. Like, the blood flow isn't quite right. And I don't know why. A Simona for you. You'll get used to it. You okay? Feel like running for the hills yet? Like, sometimes that happens. Like, I get that weird tingly feeling in my arms when I'm really nervous about streaming something. There's something really crazy going on. But there just isn't. It's, it's normal. It happens to me sometimes. It's just odd. But it's usually not when I'm streaming things like this. It's usually when I'm, like, really nervous about something that I'm streaming. Hey, now. You're an all-star. Not all. It was a lot of fun. It'll go away with a little bit of time. Yeah, I really had a lot of fun. See? Uh. Oh, who the heck are you? Sis, you okay? Mo money. <laughs> Yeah, can't say I expected this to ever be an animation in the game. Uh... New epilogue content, huh? Yeah! <laughs> Turns out, between the events of, uh, Indigo Disc and the, uh, new epilogue- Oh, I guess that's where the animation loops. It takes a long time before it does, though. Wow. Um, I guess in the time between the end of Indigo Disc and this new- Technically still Indigo Disc epilogue. Carmen got really into Fortnite during that time. We like Fortnite. We like Fortnite. <laughs> What's wrong? Is it bad that Fortnite's actually installed onto my computer right now? I haven't actually booted up or anything, but I had a, a friend that I've literally known since before kindergarten that reached out to me, <laughs> interested in playing it with me. And I, uh, I said, okay, when I get the chance, I have it installed now. Mochi, 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 mochi. Is this your big sister, Kieran? You think she wants in on the battle fun too? No way that's what's going on here. Yeah, it's ride time. So sorry, everybody, but could you help me just uh, get my sis somewhere safe? She's been playing way too much Fortnite lately. Come on, Grandma, let's get you back to bed. You want us to pick her up and drag her off? I mean, if you say so. Whatever that, me that meme is. Whereas, like, back in my day... Okay, Grandma, let's get you back to bed. Or whatever the heck that is. 